Hey guys, D Mike here. Hello and welcome back to another episode of The Legend of Zelda: Link to the Past on Super Nintendo Sundays. We finished up the Skull Woods dungeon last time, as you can tell. We're still hanging out there a little bit. And today, we're actually going to go and do another dungeon. We snagged the fire rod previously. And so we are now headed directly to the next dungeon we're going to do. Not 100% sure why the pacing of this game is set up like this. But... I don't know, I guess I can kind of imagine that maybe, 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 that the amount of Dark World dungeons is high? Hi. And they didn't really know what to do with there being so many. So you're just going from dungeon to dun- oops. I was gonna- yell at him, but it was actually my fault. I'll take responsibility and accountability one time per Let's Play, and that's all you get. So now that we are in the light world, we're actually going to want to head to the dark world, and I'm just kind of taking a very awkward path there. I don't really know how long this is going to take me to do this dungeon, so... Some people call it padding. I call it having a good heckin' time. I also completely forget where I'm going. It's been a minute. I last checked the input status of my recordings, and this is a game that I have not touched since over a month ago, actually. It's been, oops. You're not getting me this time. I think I have enough health to outlast this. I say that <laughs> very anxiously. I'm just going all the way up to Death Mountain to get to that portal. There's no real reason to actually, I, don't, I think I overshot it. There's no real reason to go that way. It's just the way that I felt, excuse you. It's just the way that I felt like going. Is this even the right one? I feel like it's not. I'm getting distracted by these bouncing balls. Don't worry, we'll make it. Hopefully you've all been well. Took a little bit of a break last week. Gotta get the old act together. Had some things I had to take care of, but we are back. Things are in order. Sometimes you just gotta get your, just gotta get your work done, viewers, you know what I'm saying? All right, so let's see where this is. Nope. Let's see where this is on the map. That's not the map button. That's the map button. All right, so we want to go to number four. Number four. It actually might be faster. If we go from home, what do you think, viewers? Sometimes you just got to go home. Which in this case is a giant pyramid. We'll see if this works. So quite a beating actually getting all the way over here. That was not really the smartest thing I've done. But what else is new? We're all playing games here after all. We're just having a good time. Not really taking things too seriously until I get into this dungeon and it absolutely tickles my cheeks and then you know that I'm gonna be probably pretty grumpy. But that's okay. Alright, where is this spot at? We went this way before, when we were getting stuff and things. This is when we just recently had acquired the hookshot. There we go. We're on the right track. Also, apologies if you can hear in the background, it is storming something fierce in my area. So, whoop. I'm recording amongst this maelstrom. I am foregoing my safety for you viewers? Who knows what could be happening? In this typhoon. I don't think there's any hearts in here. I was going to heart, 
heart up, my hopes up. Yeah. There's something, but there never usually is. All right. So we're actually headed to the Village of Outcasts. The Dark World version of Kakariko Village. And we're there. In this weird, strange area. I don't know if I did a great job exploring it, but I don't really know if there's more to do. Oh, there's a chest in here. This is probably money that I'm going to regret taking. It is! It doesn't matter. I mean, if you want to go back and max out your bombs and arrows and all that stuff, you do that. It's pretty good for you. Ooh, hammer time. This episode is brought to you by Winging It. Because I don't know what I'm doing. You can buy some stuff. Do I actually have any open... I do. You know what? It's a heart potion. Let's go back out. And... Grab another, because I don't know... When I'm going to get another fairy. I actually don't know where the last bottle is. So, these are all, oops, I don't want to use it. No, stop. There we go. Switch to something safe, the old hook shot, handy dandy. This also gives me the chance to uh, recoup some of my rupees in this dungeon. Because I haven't really been using them. That bony bird. Yeah, this area is weird. I do like the aesthetic of there being like little hoes. I think that's what these are. All right, so in the regular Cockrigo village, there's the big cock, weather cock, and uh, when you play your, your flute, your ocarina, ocarina, you get a duck. It takes you everywhere. But uh, in this one, you just pull on a trident and you go inside. Hooray, viewers, is that fun? Is that good for you? Hopefully that's good for you. Yes. So let's go ahead and explore. This looks like this is a pretty big place. Already doing good with money. Found five more dollaroos. And a heart. An auspicious start. This is kind of taking advantage of the... Um, the the different levels with the stuff and whatever, you know? Viewers, those? Whatever they call that in the Super Nintendo world? Yeah, I have no idea what's going on here. This is kind of spooky. Ooh, look at this, little jelly bean. I think we fought those before. I have no idea. Let's see what we're supposed to do. What happens if we touch this? Okay. Danger! Yeah, I'm not 100% sure what exactly is happening right now. Seems like a little bit of a maze. An amazing maze. Oop! Here's a chest. It is $20! Whoa! Very aggressive jelly beans. Easter is over. Your time is done. One of the most disgusting things. I mean, in fairness, it's not really that disgusting. Who do you think I am, viewers? Um, one of the most disgusting things that I saw during the Easter holiday, I was at the grocery store. Whoa. Dislike, go away. Um, I was at the store, and I was buying some candy for my family. Candy. And I saw with my own eyes, that you can buy soda, in this case, Pepsi, my favorite. Pepsi that is peep flavored. For those of you who don't know what peeps are, it is a little mushroom candy. Mushroom, no, marshmallow, oops. It is a marshmallow candy. Very sweet, kind of a, a strange, Kind of gritty texture. Not, not my bag. Not my favorite. Don't care for it. But it is kind of synonymous with American Easter. So, if you've never had it, you're not missing anything. 
but I saw that and I was like, absolutely not. Okay, this dungeon already just kind of sucks. I'm not sure what is going on here. I don't really care for this. But we are in Sword Beam Land. Pew, 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 pew. Very good. I'm trying to collect these treasure chests. I love treasure. Ooh, we are locked in here now. Very cool. But yes. Pepsi that is peep flavored. I was told by the people that I know that bravely tried it. Alright, let's see what the map looks like in here. Uh, great. Anyway, I was told by the people that I know, the people in my life that I'm friends with, they claim that it tasted uh, kind of like Pepsi that was a little bit too sweet, like they had dumped too much sugar into it, into the recipe. And I thought to myself, it's already pretty sweet. Don't need more of it. Declined to try any myself. Oop, I am a rabbit now. When did that happen? Excuse me. There we go. I think I must have touched that weird star configuration. I think that that's it, actually. There we go. That's fast. I feel like this dungeon doesn't really have a lot to it. Beyond. Oops. Oh, if you touch. Oh, I think I must have touched the star thing and that at the same time. That's what we call in the business the super uncool. All right, where is that door? I want to say it was back at the beginning, actually. So I will try to... Navigate... Back to said area. I don't remember. Am I actually... Oops. Can you quit? It might be up here. I just saw it. There it is. I, am I missing? I feel like I'm missing that small key wherever that's going to be. I have no idea. Unless it's... Up ahead! Oh, it's right there. Oh! That's probably something important. We'll come back to that, of course. This dungeon doesn't really feel like it's taking very long. But then again, I could be missing some sort of a gimmick. That is... Whoa! You're barfing at me. I had pizza and now it's gonna be on you! Blah. What's your favorite uh, Easter candy, viewers? Do you got one? I know a lot of people are really big fans of Reese's Cups. During Easter, the Easter holiday in America. Ooh, what is going on here? Some sort of Metroid shenanigans? Dislike. Whoa, everything is very gooey. Oh, I'm, getting, I'm getting chunked. Whoa. This is not good. Um, during the Easter holidays, they release egg-shaped peanut butter cups. I know that a lot of people like that. My family included. I personally am... I like, I like Reese's. I like a good Reese's. Oh boy, this looks horrible. Oh no. Can you give me a heart, please? I'm nervous now. I was cakewalking through that dungeon and now here I go making fun of it. This is a keys. Give me- ooh, there's a fairy. Get over here. Lady? Oh, she's like, no, I don't wanna. I don't wanna refill your hearts. No! Come back! Alright, I'm gonna try this again and see if I can get that to re-spin. This room right here, though, is... scaring the patoots out of me. Alright. That's nothing. Can this become a fairy again? No? How about you? How about you? Okay, great. Can I read this? Nope, rabbits can't read. Tricks are for kids. Okay, cool. It's me, Zelda. Don't be deceived by the magic of blind thief. Okay. I won't. When you put it like that. Oh. Uh, I, is that not, is that not good? What does this do? Not, ooh, oh, there's goobers. Well, these are like, 
These are ropes that have uh, like weird little masks on them. Look at them. They're wiggling their butts. I'm gonna get you, Link. I'm gonna wiggle my butt at you. I'm wiggling my butt at you, Link. Okay, apparently that is not what we are supposed to do. I want to say... Oh, I'm scared of this. Oh, no. Oh, what have I done? Okay, that was actually a good idea. That was not intentional, though. 100% non intentional. I was terrified of that decision. Let's put the bow on for safeties. More goodies. My goodies. All right. Switch. Nintendo Switch. If you couldn't tell, there's light shining into this dungeon, which may or may not be part of the gimmick of the final boss of this area. Nope, stop, quit. Uh, we're back to bing bongs. I was doing so well without him. Just one heart, please. No, okay. Well, good thing I bought those uh, potions. Lots of bombs for some reason. Hmm. Let's toss a bomb in the old lit area. Ooh. Alright, so we did lower those blocks, if you remember. Although, I am very nervous because I have Uno Harto left, and I am not doing so hot. And these are not reset, so... Oops. Oh boy. Oh boy, viewers, what have we done? Slow and steady wins the... Oh boy, this is gonna suck. Oh, you know, I was actually, I pretty probably should have used my potion first. That is bogus. All right, so now that these bricks are down, we head into this area. You got to have the blue boys down. I was dumb. You're barfing on nobody. Not on my watch. Okay, that's that. Oop. I don't know how you kill that, if you even do. Okay, we are... I th okay, that's where we were previously, so I'm assuming we probably need to go and explore this area a little bit. I'm feeling a little scared of the way that this is going to go. I'm not super confident. Oops. I gotta stop running this stuff. Where's your self-preservation, D-Mike? I have none. Okay. I think we can lift this. What's... What is this? Uh, I have no idea. Are we able to lift this? Yes. Take that, large block. Okay. Um, why are we in a prison? What is going on? Who's in jail? Do we have these keys? How are we opening these doors? Oh, there's a lady! Ladies! Alright, well, rap. Oh, guess rabbits can. <laughs> rabbits can unlock doors. And uh, take keys. Please, take me outside, Link! Okay. So far, so good. We have rescued the damsel in distress. I believe this is a, um... This is a similar gimmick. Ooh. That's used in A Link Between Worlds. Which is the sort of sequel to the... Oh, boy. It's a power glove upgrade. It's the Titan's Mitt. Oh, yeah. Okay. Um, We probably got to hurry. What are we ever going to do? Okay, that, was, that wasn't really as scary as I thought it was going to be. And it, the sound effect is still going. Can we... No. I just... No. That's probably not the best way to approach this. Evidence seems to point in that direction. So instead we will go the more logical route. 
I was going with my heart, viewers. Okay. You don't want to do that. Don't go with your heart. Play with your... Play with power. No, no. Okay. Ooh. That sounded very vis... Oh, no. I do not know. Ooh. I dislike this. Hmm. Is this even where I'm supposed to be going right now? How do you get out of this... How do you get out of this room? We got all these goobers ahead of us. I have to... Oops, that was dumb. Okay. Uh... Well, I should probably take a potion. If I had to guess. How many hearts does this give us? That's a full heal, baby! Alright, um... Let me think about this. So, I I feel like I probably need to go the way that I just was. But now I'm stuck in this room. Um, can I use Bombos? Are we playing with power now? Yeah, get bent. Boom. All right. Nope. All right. Maybe I just need to backtrack. Sometimes it's all you gotta really need to do is just track the back. All right, we did not open oop, any of these. We're just trying to help this lady at home. That's all we're trying to do. All right. We were uh, we were this way earlier. Oh, well, we got the sun in here now. Quite the contrary to my current situation. Let's see if uh, maybe she wants to go sunbathing with us. Let's try it. Uh-oh, too bright. Uh-oh, whoa. Well, would you know it, viewers? She turned out to actually be the villain of this dungeon. This is blind. You just gotta move around a lot. Dodge these balls. It's got two heads for some reason. Double the head, double the pleasure. Whoa! I don't think you can hit it in this form. Also, this is absolute... Absolute chaos. Um, I don't want to take damage. Um, let's see what happens if I... If I use the cane, or not the cane, the... Oh, yeah. Where am I, though? <laughs> Looks like we can do damage that way. Is that it? Oh. Okay. Sorry that that was so anticlimactic, viewers. I thought that was going to be more impressive. That worked, though. Did I cheese that? Does that... Okay, I don't know. I felt good about it. Did you feel good about it? You should have, because it was amazing. All right, we got our crystal. Time to recharge our crystals. Save another maiden. So here's a little bit more lore. We love lore. Very cool. Seems like the Knights of Hyrule need to step their game up. We're the only one holding the fort right now. How many people use the word ironic? Incorrectly, when you actually mean to say coincidence. Oh, yeah. Stroke that ego. Filling up the magics. And ladies and gentlemen, that is a dungeon complete. So there you go. Dungeon to dungeon to dungeon. We'll probably be continuing this theme a little bit. But there you go. Ladies and gentlemen, viewers... I've been Dean Mike. This has been The Legend of Zelda Link to the Past on Super Nintendo Sundays. I'll catch you next time. Bye.